There's three things, three kind of like time shift events that happened. The first one was cloud computing, right? So what that did was it brought the cost of software down and it made it easier to implement. So the rep from Oracle doesn't have to travel to Bali to install the property management system anymore on premise. Lighthouse is like, hey, go sign up on our website for our product right now. So cloud infrastructure and SaaS was like the first wave. The second wave was contactless uh, during COVID. So hoteliers were kind of sitting on their hands. They couldn't do anything. Their hotels were not open and no deal deals were happening in the market. So hoteliers are mostly thinking about how they grow their portfolio through deals. Brands are thinking about how they add new flags. So there's only one thing you can do, it's fixed process. And all processes are designed around technology. So like all of these kind of like wealthy real estate owners were like going to their team. They're usually like middle-aged to older people who are not super tech savvy. And, and they go to the young people on their team and they're like, hey, I, we got to get this tech in here so we can get guests back in. And then that's that was like another catalyst for tech and that kind of stuck around after. And I think now the third event is AI where basically in any software, there's like 80% of the features are unused. And that's because of a few reasons. Humans are, it's really hard for us to change our behavior. We're really lazy and we procrastinate. And, uh, and, and so what ends up happening is we buy something and we're like, I'm just gonna do like the three things that are like the easiest for me. And so AI is gonna unlock so many of those features for people and make software easier to use, which I think it was kind of like these three events happening basically five years apart each. That's just like, okay, once the contactless thing kind of died down, it was like, oh my God, AI is here. Year. And now it's like almost impossible for a hotel owner, even if they're like 85 year olds, you know, billionaire real estate owner to not be like, hey team, what are we doing with AI?